Double honors to the apostles and elders at Great Millstone who rule well. And as always, we give peace and salutations unto the elect. And my question to these uh, so-called celebrities, which they're getting ready to be brought low. All right, the the true uh, superstars of this earth under Yahweh Shai are the elect, and the rest of the nation of Israel when they come in their perfection. All right, all of these uh, sodomites and weirdos amongst our people who are um, who have uh, you know helped for the agenda of the left hand are getting ready to be in some very uh, uh, severe cases, man. And you have this guy Tyler Perry, who is famous for forwarding an agenda. And ultimately rebellion against the Heavenly Father in a form of cross-dressing, man. All right, so this is Daniela coming back with another lesson. The spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Racha Hakwadash. Okay, Yahweh is the name of the, of the of the Creator, the Heavenly Father. All right, by whom come all things. All right, Yahweh Shai is the name of His Son. Okay. Whom, whom, through whom all things were created, okay, and Bahashim means in the name, okay, okay, and Rachakwadash means Holy Spirit, right, which is the power, the force, okay, and uh, the knowledge and understanding of the Holy Scriptures, okay, the Bible, all right. Likewise, on top of that, you so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, or the Hebrew Israelites, the people of the Most High, so repent. Or be destroyed. Okay. So yeah. I just wanted to do a response video. I just wanted to start off by playing. You know the beginning of this video. Where you had these different celebrities. Right as you can see here. Tyler Perry. You know you saw Fantasia. I'm not familiar with the other two. But they're, they're singing this. Uh, this. Uh, 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 you know. Christian song. Okay. Saying he's got the whole world in his hands. All right now. One thing I wanted to get into is, you know, the hypocrisy, okay, of these Christians, okay, is they they help just as the bro the the brother said in Salakia, my phone does that sometimes, just as the, just as the uh, the elder said, Elder Yashawama said, you know, these people help forward the agenda, okay, of Esau Edom, right? They help forward that vibration of wickedness. Okay, confusion, disorder, okay? They they help forward that as, as entertainers, man. Okay? And he mentioned what? Cross dressing, which is against the holy scriptures. Imagine uh, uh uh were that which pertaineth unto a woman, neither a woman were that which pertaineth unto a man. Okay, which that break that basic basically is cross dressing. Okay, sodomy, okay, getting you know, amongst other things, getting your your uh your fingernails painted, okay? A bunch of, you know, just confusing things, man. And this society, man, this society is truly is truly polluted, right? Just as the scriptures say, let me get that, man, because everything in this place is polluted, 
right? And Esau eat him through his rich craft, through his media, through his TV, TV shows, uh, music. He pushes out the vibration of wickedness, man, unrighteousness, rebellion against the Most High, okay? Ant Ant Antichrist, okay? Satanism, okay, which means the word Satan means adversary, okay, or one who opposes, right? So, you know, wickedness and rebellion, uh, rebellion is, is, is uh, basically witchcraft, just as the scriptures say. But Salaki, let me stop ranting and let's get it. All right, so we're going to go ahead to uh, get my Bible app here. But yeah, man, I just wanted to do a response video, you know, real quick going into it. It might even be longer through the spirit. But, um, you know, and this is, you know, this is sort of off the top of the head. I didn't have anything planned. But, I, uh, you know, just wanted to get a video in. Um, right. So let's get it. Um, uh, what is that scripture I was, I was thinking about? Uh, okay, polluted. Right? Because I said this place is polluted, man. Everywhere you look is, is, is a wicked vibration coming out, man. You can't even watch TV. Right? You can't even... You can't leave your kids in the room and watch regular TV, okay, without, uh, 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 uh you know, without... Without something demonic coming across the television screen, man. And, you know, I don't have kids, but I'm just saying in general, man. You know, you can't leave children in front of the in front of the TV because uh, wicked vibrations will soak into their spirit, man, and influence them. Right. That's that's how wicked this place is, man. OK, let's get it. Um, I believe it's going to be in Revelations. Let's see. So, Lucky, I don't want to get the scriptures mixed up here because there's two of them that kind of sound the same here. Um, so, Lucky. There we go. This is uh, New Testament. Bear with me for a second, brothers. This is Revelations. Revelations 18 and 4, man. It says, And I heard another voice from heaven saying, Come out of her, my people that they be not partakers of her sins and receive and and that re, that ye receive not her plague so like that's not the one I'm looking for there's another one okay that might be an old testament salakia there's another one Oh man! All right, I, I'll just quote it because I don't want to, you know, waste any time. But yeah, basically, you know, the scripture where it says, uh, 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 "Come out of her, okay, for she is, uh, 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 you know, polluted, okay, and will destroy you with a sword destruction, man." Okay, but so like, I think that's right. That's it right there. Sword destruction. Let's get that. So lucky, I just want to quote this correctly. All right. Here it is, Micah 2 and 10. Arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest. Right? We can't rest in America, Babylon the Great, man. Okay? One, is going to be destroyed. Okay? And we can see that. The Lord is destroying this place from the inside out. Right? The degradation degradation of its of its economy the degradation of 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 its food supply man 
the degradation of of, of what uh, you know of of his business, man. America is a big corporation, right? They 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 trade goods and then they they sell it. They 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 make lots of money off of consumerism, man. Okay, so the laws are destroying this from the inside out, right? It already has no morals, so that's destroyed, <laughs> right? But arise ye and depart, for this is not your rest, because it is polluted. What does it mean by it's polluted, man? It's, 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 it's dirty, man. It's spiritually dirty. It's physically dirty. You can't walk outside without seeing tons of plastic and garbage all over the place. You can't walk through the woods without seeing garbage and plastic all over the place, man. You know? And if I could, I would show you, you know, you know, behind my house, there's actually a river, you know, in, in the woods behind my house. But there's nothing, there's, there's this all types of plastic back there, man, right? Which Esau, Edom, okay, the wicked, which the scriptures, you know, uh, refer to him as, he created plastic, right? And, and plastic is just a horrible material, man. But this is, this is, this is what we got to go through, man, okay, with, with the wicked being set up. Okay, so I said for it is polluted. Now, the point I want to harp on is polluted is spiritually polluted, man. There's all types of filth and wickedness and, and wicked vibrations, like I said, coming out through these TVs, through the, through the TV, man. You know, and it's like you can't even watch, you know, like the other day I was watching, um, you know, the TV show Black Lightning. Now, I did suggest to the brothers to watch that because there's some spiritual things that you can actually get out of that. But, uh, you know, eat the meat and spit out the bones, man. It's like on every TV show, they have to have some sodomite relationship, okay, some lesbo relationship happening on screen, man. Right? Happening on screen, and then it's, it's, just, a, it's, it's just ridiculous, man. It's just ridiculous, you know. It's, it's, you know. And, and the Lord is going to do away with this. That's one of the reasons why the Lord is going to do away with this place. Like he did away with Sodom and Gomorrah. It says, it shall destroy you even with a sore destruction. Right? So, hey, if, if we don't mentally and spiritually come out of here, we're going to get destroyed, man. Okay, we're going to get destroyed. So this is this this place is polluted, man. So, um, with that being said, these these different celebrities they push this this agenda, man. They push idol worship. They push they push wickedness, man. Right, and 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 and, and you know, you got these Christians. You know, when, when when things start to get hard, just like the elder said, they wanna start singing oh, you know, Negro spirituals and shit, man. Okay, you wanna say that the Lord got the whole world in His hand? Well, if you knew that, okay, if you and you know, they don't say they don't say who they're talking about. Right, just as the the brother, uh, the the elder Yashawamba said in this video, right? They could be talking about Esau, Edom. They could be talking about Satan, right? But if they talk, if they, if, I don't know who they're talking about, who they're referring to in the song. But, uh, 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 you know, if they're referring to the Most High, if you know He has the whole world in His hand, that you should have, you should have take heed. You should have taken heed, man. But no, they they kept doing. Uh, forward in Esau's agenda, right? They sold themselves out, right? And these these celebrities about to be through, man. They about to get they about to get humbled, man. They're gonna go through Jacob's trouble like every other Israelite, man. Every Israelite's gonna be going through it during Jacob's trouble. Shalakia, right? So let's let's get this. Um, cause them Shalakia to. Er, Salakia. Let me fix that. Right. Whoo! Yep. Yep. Whoo! Man, there's more than I thought on here. Okay. Okay. Here, let's get this. This is Isaiah chapter 3, and verse 12. It says, As for my people, children are their oppressors. Who's the children referring to? This Esau Edom. He's like a child, man. Right? He he, he you know, he has no order, man. He's like a, 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 a you know, 
he's basically like a child, man. Okay? He just he rules without without rules, okay? Without order. You know? It says children are the oppressors and women rule over them, right? We're living in an age where women rule over us, man. And that's out of order. And that vibration is pushed out all throughout America, right? And now America's pushed that out all throughout the world, man. Now, there's still some countries in the Middle East who ain't having it, all right? He's not having with this women independence, this feminism thing, man. That This whole feminism and women independence destroyed the family, man, right? That and, 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 and taking the, uh, the strong man, okay, out of the household. It destroyed the family, man. If you could destroy the family, you could destroy the, the, the nation, man. Okay? It says, um, Oh, my people, they which lead thee cause thee to err and destroy the ways of thy path, man. Okay? So these different celebrities who push these vibrations, okay, they, they destroy our people, man. They keep our uh, people, really, they keep our people, uh, 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 you know, separated from each other and from the Most High, right? Just as the scriptures say, uh, your sins have separated between you and the Most High, okay? Right? So they, they, destroy our, they destroy our past, man, okay? They cause us to go off. Okay, and, and uh, you know, just as the, the elder said in the video too, yeah, before we, we came into the truth, we thought that this was this was this was how things were supposed to be, man. Right? But it's not. Okay, we haven't been raised up in, in the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh like we're supposed to, man. Okay, and that's 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 a part of the curses, okay. You know, we we, we shall uh discontinue from our heritage, right? Forget who we who we were. You know, and that's all because, you know, we, we broke the law, statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. But the Lord's raising his men back up to tell you how, you know, how what you how you're supposed to be moving, man. What what's what's the whole duty of man? Let's get that. Let's get that. Hold on, let's let's get that, man. Because this is the whole duty of man. This is what this is what we're what we're supposed to do, man. This is Ecclesiastes 12 and 12. It says uh, Salakia, 12 and 13. It says, let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear the Most High and keep His commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. Right. So that's our whole duty, man. Now, on top of that, okay, fear the Most High and keep His commandments. Okay, what comes with the fear of the Most High? Right. Wisdom. Okay, when you keep the commandments, what comes more more wisdom, right? Just as the scripture says, uh, uh, um, uh, uh, wisdom cannot enter into a soul, into a malicious soul that is subject unto sin. You know, roughly paraphrasing, man. So, hey, and then with these lost statutes commandments comes what order, peace, right? So fearing the Most High and doing what He says, right, that brings order. Peace and blessings, okay, upon the nation of Israel. Now, now, um, man, now let me let me prove that, right? That that brings order, peace, and blessings, okay. Um, probably not gonna get all those points, but let's let's just get the 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 blessings, man. That comes with obeying Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, right? So let's get that. You know, like I said, I, I didn't have anything planned. There's more, more like a response to this video. It says, the Lord, Salakia, Deuteronomy 28 and 1. It says, and it shall come to pass if thou shalt hearken diligently, diligently unto the voice of Yahweh, okay, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, thy power to observe and do all his commandments, which I command thee this day, the Lord, thy power will set thee on high above all nations of the earth. Right. Boom, right? High rank, right? Nobility, okay? Uh, nobility just meaning a, a, a high birth or, or being of higher rank, man. So the Lord made us to have nobility, right? And he gave us his, his, his law, statutes, commandments, his order, okay? On how, how the, you know, to, to, uh, uh, on how to rule the earth, man. It says, and all these blessings... 
shall come upon thee and overtake thee if thou shalt hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy power. Right? So then, blessings, man. If thou, sh if thou shalt hearken unto the Lord thy power. Right? But we didn't. Okay? And, we, you know, we, we were cursed. Okay? But that's the proof right there. The fear of the Most High and keeping His commandments brings what? It brings blessings, man. So that's 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 one of the benefits. Now that's the whole that's our whole duty. But there's benefits to it, man. Okay, there's rewards to it, man. Just as it says in uh, Hebrews, okay, chapter eleven. Okay, uh, Hebrews chapter eleven and, and verse ooh, verse six. It says, "But he." Um, but without faith, it is impossible to please him. Okay? For he that cometh to the Most High must believe that he is, okay? And that he is the rewarder of them that diligently seek him. Right? So there you go, man. The Lord rewards you for, for doing what he says. Right? But, you know, these celebrities don't, 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 don't see the reward in that, man. Really, the only ones who will see the reward is the elect, man. Lord willing, I'm a part of that. But you know, let's let's go back to those uh those different scriptures there. But yeah, man, um, this is Isaiah 9 and 16. It says, For the leaders of this people cause them to err, and they that are led of them are destroyed. Right? So basically the same thing, different different location in the scriptures, man. So yeah, man, these people they forward this, man. They they forward this, this this you know this this weird freakism behavior, man. A and A, man. You know, according to the scriptures, you know, you know, in the recent uh, edification, you know, for me, because I I didn't know before. According to the scriptures, man, uh, uh, uh oral sex, okay, uh, and and and, and 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 anal sex and all that shit, man. That's sodomy, man. That's as the scriptures call it. Uh, that's that's a uh, 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 inordinate affection, man. Now, uh, being a young man growing up, growing up here in uh, 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 in Babylon, the great man, we thought that hey, we thought that you know, oral sex was cool, right? We grew up thinking that 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 oral sex was cool because of the vibration that was being pushed on us, man, right? But then coming into this truth, we found out that that's actually disgusting, man. That's actually against the most high. Right? But hey, you know, ultimately this is what's coming, man. That's you know, I'ma just end it off here. Ultimately, this place has to be destroyed. Okay? The the uh the uh the uh uh <laughs> this wicked radio station <laughs> has to be uh, uh, uh terminated, man. Right? You know how you have a, a radio station, right? They got the radio tower sends out different waves right w which really is just you know vibrations and, and gamma rays uh you know carrying information throughout the air when you look it up but right this 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 wicked frequency has to be put out the earth man and the lord's gonna destroy this wicked frequency out the earth right first by destroying the source and then by laying down the law okay which he's gonna th do through his son yahweh upon his 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 return right so let's get this. Um, um, exceeding. Polluted. Salakia. I hope I'm finding. Look, if, I'm a, I hope I find the right one. Bear with me for a second, brethren. Oh, so lucky. Nope. Trying to find this scripture. Uh, 
or the second Ezra is 15. All right, this wasn't the one I'm looking for, but uh, I'll still read it. Second Ezra chapter 15 and verse 6. For wickedness hath exceedingly polluted the whole earth, and their hurtful works are fulfilled. Right? So it's it's time for this place to be destroyed, man. Right? It's, it's just about time. Let me say that, Salakia. It's just about time for this place to be destroyed. Right? Because no man knoweth, you know, the, the, the hour, okay, that the Lord's going to send his son back to destroy this place. Right? But we can see... Through the different prophecies coming to pass that, hey, man, it's close. Okay? So it says, therefore, saith the Lord, I will hold I will hold my tongue no more touching their wickedness, which they profanely commit. Neither will I suffer them those things in which they wickedly exercise themselves. Behold, the innocent and righteous blood crieth unto me, and the souls of the just complain continually. Right, man? So the Lord's... The Lord uh, is going to come a point, man, and is, we were approaching that where the Lord is not going to take this anymore, man. Right? He, he's going to judge this place horrifically, man. Thermonuclear destruction. Millions of missiles, man, which is kind of like, oh, that's like overkill. But, hey, man, that's what the Lord is going to do, man. He's going to make this a memorial of, uh, of if you if you do wickedness, this is what you get. Right? So, you know... Uh, let's select you. Let me get the scripture I was looking for. Let's get it. Sinful kingdom. That's the one I was looking for. Sometimes you get these scriptures mixed up. Amos 9 and 8. It says, Behold, the eyes of the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai are upon the sinful kingdom, and I will destroy it from off the face of of the earth okay saving i will not utterly destroy the house of jacob saith the lord right so hey man there you go it says his eyes are upon a sinful kingdom he's going to destroy it off the earth what's the sinful kingdom uh, uh uh babylon the great america okay this that's the america's the source okay of this wicked vibration going out man it's the source okay now, when I say source, I mean in the current world, this is where most what most of that wicked vibration and witchcraft and where the vibrations coming out. Now, as for where they got all that stuff, you know, the source comes back from the ancient world, from these other nations all compiled together, right? But you know, you you Lord, Lord, I'm gonna, I'm making sense and you you understanding this is edifying. It says, and I will destroy it from off the face of the earth. So the Lord's gonna destroy this place, man. That's that's the end game. Right for this place to be destroyed, saving that I will not utterly destroy the house of Jacob, saith the Lord. Okay, and when you think about it, the majority of the house of Jacob is in the Americas, man. Okay, you got you got all, you know, all the tribes in America, right? Well, really, all the tribes are scattered all over the place, man. But for as many things that are going to be destroyed, especially America, the Lord is going to have a remnant. Right, the elect whom he chose from the foundation of the earth to, to, to not be destroyed, okay, and to make it through this coming tribulation, man. Okay, so you know, Lord willing, this was edifying. Once again, want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Racha Hakwadash, double honors to the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, and Shalawam to the hopeful elect brethren, teaching and pushing this word in sincerity and in truth. Shalawam.